Hello and welcome back to Empyrean Galactic Survival Reforged Eden 1.7. My name is Spanch. Welcome to the trade station. We are trading today uh, with the guys up here because I need to make enough money so I could come to this guy back on Beta 3 and buy five of his ancient relics for 67,000. While we're here, of course, we can give this guy his Ahax fruit. You have no idea how much this helps me. Trust me, you have no idea how bad the headache I've gotten from this problem has been. His take this vegetable soup on the house. You've earned it. Good help. Thank you very much. And we can give this guy his leather. I've brought you the leather you wanted. Thank you for your help in this. Here's your payment of 25,000 credits for all your help. It'll make many of the residents very happy no problem wonderful so we can return to roggery give this guy the salt that he's looking for thank you very much this guy the crossbows that he's looking for very nice and this guy the six ancient relics that he's looking for my guy is going to be very happy with this he'll also pass on his recommendations to his business partners in the syndicate i hope you like being listed as a stand-up guy in the books of lowlifes <laughs> happy to help i guess maybe that nets us 130,000, almost double what we paid for those relics for. So that's delicious. That gives us a total money, money card, sort of total. Look at this, look at this. Let's go and put this in the cash machine. Um, so before this goes in, I have a balance of 92,000 credits. And now we have a balance of half a million. 508,000 credits. Ooh. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> that was alright, that wasn't it. Of course, I had uh, 10 fertilizer left over from one of the missions as a reward. And that means we can do the third mushroom farmer mission over here at the Talon. There you go. Some use for some fertilizer. We're going to get a better price for it here than we will if we sell it anywhere else. So, if you do happen to have a uh, fertilizer, just go and see a mushroom farmer and you'll get the best price for it. That nets us another 4,200. Oh, and a poster. Some gold and some leather. <laughs> Lovely. And we still got five left over after that as well. So now we can come to various trade stations to buy small upgrade kits. Also, we can build this. Bingo. Build it some ammo. Come to this moon and deploy it. Here she is. She's such a little dinky tank. <laughs> She's got a fueler. Put some Pentax in. Now there's no oxygen tanks in this Scorpion. It's a short range vehicle only. Plenty of ammunition capacity though. As you can see, we've got 84 shots with the big cannon. 41 reloads with the uh, lasers and 3,200 128 AP rounds. Because on this thing, it's got the heavy gaps on the front there. Just squeezing in a little extra firepower per square meter on this teeny tiny little beast. Uh, but this should prove more than a match, hopefully, for the little anti aircraft can cannons over there. Let's get the shields charging and make sure she is at peak performance and ready to go. All right, because that's right, ladies and gentlemen, today is the day that we are taking on the radar complex, the final part of the story missions, at least. Uh, the first story missions, I suppose. And um, we have this radar complex here, which has got a few nasty turrets in it. I can't even see them right now. 400 uh, meters away. We have a range of 490 meters on this cannon. Uh, although hitting that target is going to prove very difficult. Let me just see. Is that even, is that even the target? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I wonder if it's sort of underground or something, because, uh, wait, where the hell is everything? I should be in render rage at this distance. Why isn't any of it loaded in? Oh, there it is. Bloody hell. Yep. We're in range now. We're taking shots. Return fire, in fact. Oh, no, it's out of render range. Wait, are we on the map? Is this the crease? Is that what this line on the ground is here? Suddenly we're we're in range and then out of range. Oh, that's unfortunate positioning. I couldn't even see that on the map. 
Right, let's uh, back off a second here. We need to hit this turret from uh, outside of its range, ideally. I think we just got it, though. Maybe? Still taking shots from something. Whoa! <laughs> what was that? Cheeky bastard. Still taking shots. Damn this thing. Right, there we go. I don't know what is shooting. I suspect it's the other turret is in range. Somehow. That guy there. This is why I wanted this tank was... We could do that sort of thing. Let's see, does that hit the target? That overshot the target. Now we're getting shot again, look. We have to try and wiggle it. <laughs> uh, the, the shields are actually holding reasonably well. I'm trying to get the mouse cursor in there. It's not highlighting as red, so I think we're maybe... Oh, we got it! <laughs> sniped! Absolutely sniped! Alright, so that's two down. There's two more. I need to get in range of... I assume that's a drone that the laser cannon is firing at. Turret over there. And that one was a direct hit. That looked like a direct hit, but actually I think it missed. Get a bit closer. Now we're definitely in range. Now that the cursor turns red, we're definitely in range, and boom, there it goes. That was one of those green ion spitty things, they really kill your shields. Remember what that thing did to the dropper when we threw by this place. Now we can get in a bit closer. Whoop! What is that? Some kind of EMP thing? There goes that turret as well. And then the base itself has got repulsor turrets on it by the look of it. Boom! There goes that one. Just waiting for a reload right now. Whoa! Hey! Take a fire! There's another turret. I didn't see it. There's another repulsor turret. Let's see. Oof. Ooh, this thing is got my number, isn't it? All right, let's see if we can get some shots on it. Shield's holding nicely, though. There's a shot out. I'm hoping that destroyed it. Nope, we got one more shot. Of course, this works all very well and nicely because this place doesn't seem to have any shields on it. Um, but if it had shields, it would be a different story. You'd have to rely heavily on that laser cannon to um, take the shields down while we, we weren't getting shot in return. One more repulsor. I mean, this cannon is a bit tricky. Come on, baby. There he goes. There we have it. The area is secure. Okay, fantastic. We can move in now then. Let's go get the ship. We're going to need it because I need what's in the fridge. I need what's in the boxes. Right, my sentry guns for some reason are opening up on something. You guys shouldn't even be like... What are you doing? Sentries. Bases. Off. No, 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 no. Stop it. <laughs> what are you shooting? And shoot the bases, yeah. Stop it. Thank you. You done? Good. Right, so, um... Whew, when we did uh, The Abandoned Tomb an episode or two ago, I missed a secret room. I think I put a little thing in there in the edit to point that out. I did go back and get it, and as a result, I got one of these things. This is a high output plasma cannon. It is an emergency F off button. Um, I also got a bunch of matrices out of that as well, which was lovely. Okie dokie. So that's where that came from. Uh, we had that before. We had the minigun before. And of course, we had this uh, before as well. Uh, before I made the cock up regarding the ammunition types. It was weird because when I put the right ammunition in, it didn't update the number in the bottom. It confused the hell out of me. 
and then I didn't realize that 15 mil had been renamed to 128 mil, and so on and so forth. <laughs> Any idea where I should look, Ida? Right, good. The mission is triggering. I found a door. Now, um, I think this has been updated since... Um, that was a headshot that was denied. Thank you. Ow. Since I last run this thing. The hell, these things are just tripping all over the shop. What is going on? Uh, the only problem with this is I, I don't think I can have the, um, like, marksman mission kill 100 Xerax with sniper rifles active while I have the main mission active, you know what I mean? So all the Xerax I'm going to be killing here are not going to count towards that mission, which is a shame. Uh, but it is what it is. We'll, uh, we'll have plenty of opportunities to kill 100 Xerax at another time. Oh, this thing's beautiful. Oh, this thing's beautiful. So this looks very, this looks a lot like you know what it was before so I'm seeing no differences yet but from the chat I've seen from um, other people on my server there, there's definitely something new about this place I don't know we shall see he just ran out then didn't he just ran out didn't he come on oh I was not ready for you now go back in disable external defenses yeah go on oh look at that see you didn't need to blow them up you could just disable the external defenses good to know so you guys are doing this. You don't need to build a tank to blow up everything. You can just uh, use the little... Actually, do you know what? That radar station, uh, that comms ray is in range of that fortification, so I'm not sure. I think I would have um, been in conflict either way. That's nice. Thank you, Xerax. Oh, come on. <laughs> nice, conveniently located uh, medical station there. Uh, oh, that's got me on edge. I want to loot that box, but I keep hearing doors opening. Wow. Okay, let's um, just chuck all this in there. We're going to connect to the biscuit, and we're going to chuck that all in the misc box. All right, let's move on. back. Whoa! I'm on fire! I'm on fire! Where's that medical terminal? I'm on fire! <laughs> Biscuit! Bridge! Put me out! Water! Thank you. This that freaking thing is amazing. These are nasty bastards, these are, aren't they? These Zaraxian scummers. These are gonna take a little bit. They're very aggressive. They're very, very aggressive. Okay. Alright, cool. Move on. We've got to clear this 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 floor. Uh, wardrobe with a shotgun in it. Lovely, thanks. I guess. There you go. You got another one up there? No? Okay, good. This is where we get a lot of our boosts and stuff. Oh, a little bit of ammo. Meds. Did that loot? Yeah. Meds. Poster. I'll take it. Sometimes there's a Xerax up here, so it's being extra cautious. Uh, there we go. Maybe we could get a boost at some point. It was making me out to be a liar, but uh, we got there. We got there in the end. Right. Uh, now, as far as I'm aware, the right click of this is anti-ship mode. And we can basically go one-shot that mother. <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> Delay the sentry gun. Oh, we got another one. Hang on. 
Hi. Die. So we have definitely got a way to remove sentry guns very, very easily and very nicely. Right. I think that's the last room. Um, we've got some fridges here, so let's loot these. And some more over here. Ribs. Nice. Very nice. Right. Taking all their food. There's one more section. Before we go downstairs, we need to go up. Cheeky shotgun, Xerax. Bleeding. <gasps> the door is half open. How weird. Stay still. Damn turd muffin. Why is that going in the fridge? That doesn't go in the fridge, does it? That goes in the misc box. Misc box, come on! That is that. There's an ATM here. I use it. No can. <laughs> awesome. Let me pay in some of these Xerox credit cards. <laughs> <laughs> your money is mine now okay so that is the top level cleared and that is the same as it was before no changes there let's move on now we go down these stairs here and this is where things basically end up killing us okay oops that's pushing us that way Clear. I don't know how I missed, but I missed. Spending a thousand of them, that's why I got the minigun out. It's like I'm gonna need to be able to shoot a lot really quickly. But I got those both down. We thought I said anti tank rifle, I would be able to one shot those robots. But they're only level ones or something, so I guess. Uh, they're a lot weaker than, than maybe they usually are. There's more sentry guns around here. I need to be able to remember where they are. Sit down, you. There's one. Got him. Got him. Not quite sure how, but I got him.
They come from every direction, every which way. You never know where they are. But I think I got them all. Alright, let's move on. I'm out of reach. So this side of the station, I have no range on my biscuit. I'm going to go through here now. Okay. Oh, I see. They breach my suit. So there's an oxygen vent right above me, so how am I out of oxygen when they breach my suit? <laughs> it's silly. I mean, I, 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 get, I get where you're coming from. It's a nice little thing, but it's not, not wholly thought out, is it? <laughs> There's oxygen right there. <laughs> you should take my helmet off. How's that? Hmm? <laughs> now, now if I re get my suit breached. Eh? <laughs> Maybe I'm taking things too literally. Let's um, just grab all of this and I'll put it in the ship. It's all going to be meds and uh, food and water and nonsense like that. Yeah, this is all still the same as before. I see. Oh, hello. <laughs> I, the, I better check above me, just in case. Hello, right there. Yeah, I think there is another spawner up there as well. Um, grab your stuff. Crew? Oh. Crew? Uh. Crew? Uh. Uh. <laughs> uh. 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 Radiation belt though. Not bad. I'll take it. Good job, Xerax. You had me banged to rights there. You could have popped out and absolutely nailed me, but uh, you suck. So, you know, whatevs. I'll take it. <laughs> Don't complain too much. All right. Damn it, now I can't see the spawner. Cheeky! Hmm. I hear them. We got this. Stupid mechanoid.
Jerex commander down. Alright, we're nearly there. This could be a problem. <laughs> I was kind of like, that's an ammo box, I wonder if it'll explode. <laughs> yeah, that thing's awesome. God, they're dumb. They're just like freaking training dummies sometimes, I tell you. Sometimes they like, they get me when I make a mistake. And then sometimes they just sit there. <laughs> it's just be like, yeah, chill. Whatever. I'm gonna die. It's a player. Doomed. <laughs> and it's like, ah. Uh... You should always try, Zirak. You should always try. Even when the odds are stacked against you, my friends. Get all these little bits and bobs then. It's affecting a sentry gun. Oh, that's nice. He's updated that so it's not a freaking. Oh, I can't damage with that weapon. Why not? Oh, what? Oh, yeah. There's no O2 in here. <laughs> I'm like, why? What? <laughs> I've got. What? <laughs> Right, find the floor plan of the radar station. Wait, what? Oh, right, I need to go all the way back up. Ah, oh, damn it, okay, fine. Um, I wasn't paying attention to the mission, I just assumed... You see, this is the problem, I autopilot. I autopilot. I'm like, I've done this a thousand times, let's just go, 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 go. Alright, let's find the floor plan. At least we've cleared it out now, we can uh, we just go back and do that. Um, that's up the top, so I think we probably just walk straight past it. Right, here we go. Currently displaying floor plan of radar station complex. Your clearances visitor. You are not allowed to view classified data logs recordings. If you would like to upload this floor plan to external device, please enable uploading in your browser settings. <laughs> uh, from the floor plan, I estimate that the Xerox are likely conducting the decryption in the basement levels of the station. The lower levels are heavily populated with the station personnel. Yeah. Cool. Top of health up. The basement level. No problemo. Let's go. Beyond this door is a large room used for religious rites. By the facility personnel base. Okay, we're going through the medical facilities. Following the corridor from the med bay, we pass through generator room and armory before reaching primary control on the far edge of the facility. Okay. Sorry, I would have done this if I had uh, not just autopiloted through this thing, because... This is an oldie. Done it before. But the mission's new, in fairness. Not done the mission before. Right, now we can go to the primary control board. Hello. There's nothing here. They must have taken the data somewhere else. Done! <laughs> Rats! Uh, there's nowhere else in this facility that can handle the data, tit the Titan data, and no ships have left the radar station. It must be there, Commander. Ida, I'm telling you, man. Ain't, ain't nothing here. What do you want from me? Access the primary control board. Fine, All right. I found the main computer. It wasn't particularly well guarded or hard to get to. Something's not right here. It seems I was wrong, Commander. The Titan data is not here. Duh. Uh, well, this terminal should at least say where it could be. Access the system. Primary control board directory. Blah. Two grills, one... Oh my gosh. <laughs> what the hell was this guy watching? <laughs> Uh, I don't think I'll continue watching that, thanks. Okay, moving on! <laughs> thanks for a million. That's great. Love that reference. Um, update alien personnel on site. Sending extraction team. Looks like they are watching the Titan or for someone, me in this case, to come and attempt to fix or recover it. I played right into their hands. Let's see what happened with the extraction team. Um... 
Mission accomplished. Data retrieved. Titan computer has taken the Xeno mainframe for decryption processing. Asset C SC-14 en route to data recovery. Defend radar station and eliminate all alien asset. Uh, what the hell is asset SC-14? Unknown. Enemy. Encounters. Classified. Black 66. Interesting. But not what I'm looking for. Uh... Data. Oh my god, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> the Titan data seems to be taken to the Zenny mainframe, but it's classified. Do you know anything about this mainframe building? I've accessed an unprotected console on the other side of the facility, Commander. The Zenny mainframe is located 500 meters below the radar station complex in a self contained module, not connected. How do I get there if it's half a kilometer underground? I can't exactly dig that far. I have. Yeah, we can. I have obtained a schematic of the first floor of the mainframe and it seems that the access to the module is handled by a teleporter. There's a lockdown teleport, the opposite. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, we know the teleporter. It's currently offline, but you can activate it with the lever in the room. How convenient. My connection to the console to the other side of the base has been cut. It seems that our intrusion has been detected and reinforcements have been deployed to block our path. All right, log off. Flippity flip. Oh, shit. What? 5018. Thank you. Flippity flipped. Oh, crap. A lot of stuff just spawned. Like you! But you're dead, so that's fine. Ha ha ha! Oh ho ho ho! Oh ho ho! Shut up. Shut your front face. Just shut up right now. That's disgustingly beautiful. They freaking... Oh. Hi. Do you mind? I'm having a moment! Honestly, the rudeness. So you take laser rifle charge. That's these bad boys, yeah? Which I actually have, like, some of now. All right, all right, all right, all right. We gotta, we gotta work on this a second. Right. Hold on. Just give me a minute. Just, I need to refrigerate some stuff. Small arms, more laser rifle rounds. <laughs> Minigun, you're being retired. Sorry. There's not enough room for you. I've already got 61 reloads of this thing, but still. Yes! 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 The Xerax are going to die. The Xerax are going to die. The Xerax are already dying, but they're going to die even more. <laughs> Hi! Where are you at, Xeraxians? I have some laserage to laser you with. What's up, bitch? What's up? Brother Ducker? Who's next? Ow. Damn it, Dermal what? Dermal your burn. Yeah. Let's go! I am invincible! <laughs> this thing's awesome. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Okay, uh, I have a dermalage of the burnage. Um, let's go with that one. No, that's a wrong one. Let's go with one that works. <laughs> that one, and that's ablative spray. That should stop us from getting that in nasties for ten minutes. Now then. Where were we? Ah, uh, yes. Laserage. <laughs> yeah, you started to run away when you realised, didn't you? I know, but it was too late. Too late for you. Ah, oh, too late. Hi, chaps. How you doing? Die. Die. This is awesome. Uh, the sniper's great, don't get me wrong. But there's something just so, like, F you guys with this gun. Hi. <laughs> Where are the others? Where are you? Ah. Bitch. Actually, screw using my own meds. I can use Xerox meds. Were you an elite shotgun dickface? I think you were, weren't you? Alright, let's move. Transmission wing. Now then, lots of sentry guns in here. Lots of sentry guns. That guy, and that guy, and that guy. And they see you. You got melted, mate. Whoa! Quick little bastards, aren't they? I like, missed all my shots there.
<laughs> beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Give me your bits. I want your giblets. Meat for days. Another one. Another one. No! Wow. One shot. One shot. How many bullets did I waste on that first one? Like, just sprayed all over the place then. <laughs> Damn. Alright, let's hit up a bandage a second. Kind of hungry. Let's have some vegetable soup. Let's go. Oh. No. Two shots. Hi. <laughs> Here's the delayed reaction. It's like, oh, it didn't. Oh, no, it didn't. <laughs> oh, it didn't work. Yep, it did. Just took a little minute, you know? They changed the plasma cannon so it's less like explodey and more just delayed death. We don't need to go in there, but I generally always do just to clear out the robots and that guy. Leave him out of plasma rounds. Hold up. Missed. There's so many footsteps outside. What is going on? Are we in trouble? Uplink control room is here. That's what spidey senses look like. <laughs> that is what spidey senses look like. Alright. Alright. Mm, something doesn't feel right here. Something's going to come back and chew my butt off. I know it. I know it. And sure enough, a ripper dog sneaking up behind. Oh yeah. They do get you every now and again. They do get you. Alright. Let's see. The door to the teleporter is somewhere. Ooh, good. Do we have to flip it a flip it a ah ah ah. Where the hell did you come from, big face? Honestly, did he just spawn out of thin air? That sucks. That's rude, is what that is. Alright, I think we have to flip it a, flip it a switch. This, uh, this boy. It's a good gun. Such a good gun. That took a lot of health off. That was an error. Didn't check my corners, see? Check those corners. Um, There's a couple of dudes down here. Did this come out? No. Damn it. How am I supposed to get over here? I can't. I need to go round and down. A motorbike. What the hell? 
Was that that freaking plant? Hitbox just saved that Xerox life. Not for long, but still irritating. It's an epic down here. Look at that. Worth it. What do we got? Ooh, delicious. Uh, rich asteroid mining drills. Ah! So we got the apple seed brews. <laughs> oh, God. Maybe we can sell them. And the rich asteroid mining drills. That's awesome. That's awesome. Happy days. Very happy days. Good looting. All right. Then, uh, cool. So there has been some updates to this thing, but it's largely mostly the same. But let's see what happens to the mainframe, whether that's any different now. Let's go. Okay. Um, you've got to be freaking kidding me with your re... Assholes come from. Unreal. Son of a biscuit. All right. Topping my health up. O2 is reasonable, but let's grab some temporary O2. Let's put some stuff in the fridge as well and empty this out. I'm going to put these two on because there is an armor locker right here. So let's get ourselves some extra armor and some extra mobility. Bingo. Uh, shouldn't need food, but we'll take ration packs as well. And let's, uh, let's top up with some of this stuff and another vegetable soup. All right, let's do this. Let's go. Here we go. All right, welcome. Okay, this is definitely different. Wow, this is completely different. Okay, I have no idea where I'm going, what to expect now. This is new and shiny. All right, this looks awesome. Calculating new route. What? That looks... Sus. Don't like it. This is a vermilion build, so it's going to kill me. And that's that's simply that's that's what it is. Uh, which means every single nook and cranny needs to be checked as well, because he hides stuff everywhere and anywhere. Right. Have you got a way to avoid that? I'd rather not get my goose cooked. You can access the ventilation in the maintenance shaft behind you. That leads to a circuit breaker that controls the power to the windows to the observation room. Okay. With the windows obscured, the Xerox will need to make a visual inspection, which will require them to disable the security checkpoint and authorize you personally. Okay. I feel like I've missed a bit of this. Hold up. Hold up. Bap, bap, bap. Drone, drone, drone. Drone, 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 drone. Drone? Hmm. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> we got a console there. We got a shut door that is locked. Right. Let me just check a second. I'm going to go back through the PDA. Current can you may bypass the security checkpoint ahead. Do not attempt to bypass the checkpoint with force. I have found a way to bypass the security checkpoints. Where you enter the checkpoint at present, the guard would close the door and activate the incinerator. That would very quickly kill you. I hope you've got a way to avoid that. You can access the ventilation in the maintenance shaft behind you. That leads to a circuit breaker that controls the power to the windows to the observation room. With the windows obscured, the Xerox will need to make a visual inspection to require them to disable the security checkpoint and authorize you personally. Right. That's this, right? Yeah, it's damaged. I knew that looked fishy. It's the only thing in this entire place that is out of place, if you know what I mean. Okay. Ah. I'm detecting transmission from the observation room commander. They do not appear to be happy. Transmission. So it was summarized that our ploy was successful. So now I can go in. You will then... Right. It should be safe to pass through the security checkpoint and engage the security personnel in the control room. You will then have to access the mainframe. So do I flip it to that and then the flip it to that? Cheeky. Right, hang on. I don't understand what's happening now. Pop up the health. 
Hey, who's in the incinerator? The system is down again, so I need to approach the comm terminal and read me. So you have to pass a security check before they can enter the control room. I think I may be in trouble here. I have no solution for you, Commander, but the only thing I can offer a session is bluff. The Ice Guard. Hey, you there, pal. Answer me before I turn on the heat. Yeah, I'm here. Um, how's it going? What? We can't hear you. The console is broken. God damn it all. <laughs> Not that too. Why does everything break when I'm on duty? Why couldn't it be someone else's job this time? Can you hear me now? I think I got it. What? I can't hear you. <laughs> Stop yelling. <laughs> you may well want to hear me, but I can damn well hear you. Let's be through. I can't hear you. Okay, I'm letting you through. Just pull the lever behind you. Show your ID. Thanks. What the hell is going on? Why have I got gooey stuff happening on my screen? Some bitch. Hey, what's going on in there? Clark, answer me. Carlark, Car answer me. Carlark, what is going on? Why have I got bad trip or whatever? You are suffering from a hangover. Please fix hangover. Crap. I'm so far out of range of my ship. Did I not bring water with me? Son of a bitch. Indigestion, food poisoning. Yeah, okay. Well, I could really use some indigestion bad trip. Seriously? Come on, a herbal tea should really cure hangover. That is some BS right there. Do these guys have any? What is giving me a hangover? Is it the rum? Oh, I know what it is. The bloody rum I took, wasn't it? Uh, it's worn off. Right, what am I doing? Answer the call. Oh, yeah. Sorry. This appears to be a communication console. I need to reactivate it. Yep. Uh, what? Answer the call. This appears to be a communication console with a line open to somewhere else in the base. I need to get closer. Attention on personnel. We have intruder in the security. Suck it, bitch. Come on. What's going on? There should be a way to disable the locks of the living quarters on the lower level through the storage bay, Commander. The storage bay? Enter the storage bays. Uh-huh. I can't. The, the door's locked. Damn, this bad trip is really... Do my head in. <laughs> oh! I mean, I needed to go through there. They opened the door. It wasn't me. Needed to get through there real quick. I'm so hung over for this. Is that double burn? How dare you! Okay, my, my hangover is about to um, transform into something. I don't know what it escalates to, but it's going to escalate. Does something. I'm sorry about the wavy waviness. That's causing nausea. <laughs> Not much I can do about it right now. Okay, you are dehydrated. Replenish fluids by drink juice. Dehydration? Bad trip. Brilliant. Um, now the herbal tea works. Yay! Dumb will burn. And let's ablate it up. Beautiful. Okay, we're good. We are good. Let's hit up a bandage. Get that health restoring. Xerox civilian. Let's try not to be the murderous bastards that they are. Ooh, lots of storage here. Lots of shiny things. Uh, according to the floor plan, I have the first floor of the mainframe. There is a maintenance shaft to access the facility generator room from the storage bay. Uh huh. Okay. Um, 400 of 700 storage. Um, no way to loot into anything. Let's see what what we. Ooh, access code. Mm -mm, interesting. Wonder what secrets lie in there. Oh, nice. I just got two bridges. Uh, matrices, rather. That's nice. Get some good stuff here. Right, this this here, I think, is uh, where we need to go. Can I destroy that? Is that damaged? Yes, it is. Get rid of that. I wonder what the code is for that box. Whether it's anywhere in this room, you know? Like, secret code. 
Secret code. Secret code. Have a little look around, see if we can find it somewhere. Let me like sneakily hidden on a screen. Hey, chill, dude. I work here. One, two, three, four. Easy to remember her. Don't kill me, please. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Look at that. It's freaking great, right? Let's get rid of some junk. Titanium plates, sathium plates, optical fiber. That sort of stuff. Let's build up on the juice. It's, the juice is more important. Okay, that's more valuable. That's more valuable. Right, good. Okay. We'll have to do a little bit of inventory swapping as we go. That's awesome. I love that little dialogue come up. That was great. This is cool. All right, here we go. Generator room then. Find the generator room. We're on it. I'm so glad I got this gun. Honestly, the sniper rifle is great. I love it. Like it's one hot, one shot headshot capacity is amazing, but the just the oh shit reaction speed of this thing is just legendary. Alright, I'm staying away from that generator as much as I can, but I am 90 degrees C. Let's do this quickly. Uh, lockdown in effect, basically. Lots of uh, stuff. Access logs, maintenance logs, or fire detection system. Oh, fire detection system. Let's do it. No fires detected. Activate fire alarm. Caution, fire alarm has been activated in the living quarters. All, unlocking all security doors. <laughs> nice! I love it. Can I access the other logs? Usage logs. Tanks are refilled. Fire detected kitchen. Diagnostics end. Inconsistent halon levels. <laughs> Jesus, the detail. Uh, the detail is amazing. Maintenance logs. Refilled after the suppression system went turned on due to missing closing brackets in the, something or other. This is the third diagnostics. Tanks come out. Um... I think we'd be intentionally inhaling for fun. <laughs> I love it. All right, fine. Let's move. Uh, that should unlock the doors back here then. Oh, we've got to be careful. Yeah, no, I'm not going to shoot you. You're fine. You haven't got a gun pointing at my head, so, you, you know, you're fine. Again, these... Are, oh, maybe I just need to get close. Ah, <laughs> That hurt a lot. That made a lot of pain. Get out of here, yeah? Uh, I've reached the mainframe living quarters. I'm sorry, Commander, I have no idea of the floor, lower floor layout. Well, what's shooting me? Oh, you! Cheeky little pop-out bastard. Yeah, that got me. Fair enough. Didn't expect the living quarters to be so heavily guarded. Bloody hell. This is intense, dudes. Oh, nice. Very rare. <laughs> uh, I'll take the laser pistol because I won't be able to carry the other two, being my ship is... Well, all the way over there. I Hopefully not getting destroyed by regenerating POIs. We can come back to this place and bring the ship here and really loot it and stuff. I hope so. Because we are running out of space here. Uh, can I put anything in the factory actually? He exploded twice. Do it. Ah! Son of a headshot. Yeah, shut up. <laughs> uh, no match for this gun. All right, moving on. Let's go. I think I'm out of plasma blaster. I'm out of plasma cannon.
All right. Made it all the way around. Damn, the doors are locked. There's got to be a way past that blast door. Huh. Look at another bloody trap. What does that switch to? Enter lock code. Huh. Cooling tower control board. Warning, turbines are operating at 100% capacity to keep the mainframe system cool. Excess heat by, produced by the power system is shunted into heat sinks and dumped into the moon's regolith. All right. In the event of an obstruction to a turbine, um, pull both shutdown levers located in each tower. Code 7149. Do not shut down both turbines at the same time or you risk overheating the system causing an explosion that will deal significant damage to the mainframe's infrastructure. What was the code again? 7149. 7149. Uh, Air-cooled system. Right. Yeah, we're going to be shutting down both things, aren't we? <laughs> yep. 7149. Here we go. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Oh! That opened, but it closed. It opened, and then immediately closed again. And now I can't open it. Oh no! Hang on. I wonder if another path has opened up. Uh, no, it's just blown off the... Oh yeah, it has. Look. Lovely. Okay. I thought that was a bug there for a second. Got him. Oh man, there's so much good stuff they gotta take with me. I mean that was kinda oh yeah, take those. Thank you very much. Oh plat. Platinum. You should be able to come back and get this stuff with like a proper loot thing. Other faction. Huh. They damaged. Nope. Hey yo! Open the door! Still in the middle of decrypting the Titan, so the fleet should he say shut it down. Retrieve the Titan data. Oh, good. Tip. Get through the Oh, thanks. <laughs> Don't close. Uh damn it! Dermal burn. Again. I don't have an ointment on me and my, my thing run out. Uh okay, retrieve the Titan data. Hello, Commander. It seems you did alright without me. Eh, I'm not completely useless now, but even I can't stop the decryption process without the command code. I'm sorry, Commander. I cannot bypass the command code either. I can, however, access the decrypted data and download it. The rest can be purged from the system before the Xerox take to retake the facility. That leaves everything to chance that the data they've already decrypted contains the warp coordinates to the fleet's location. Without that data, we're dead in the water. Again. Safeguarding the fleet and the warp field generator technology is more important than finding them, Commander. The coordinates may still be in the decrypted data, and Polaris is still a viable source of information. There are other ways to rejoin the fleet, Smanch. Hmm. What if I let the decryption complete? Ooh, I like this. Two options. Oh, ho, ho, ho. which one do we go for? Damn! That is a toughie. That is a toughie. And it's going to have to wait until the next episode because we're playing out of time today. <laughs> I know! I'm a bastard. But thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And hopefully I'll see you next time. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.